Sorry, I'm a little bit later than I intended for. It's, it shits happens, basically. Um, but I hope you all are doing well. I uh, am doing okay. But uh, before we get properly started, just a quick reminder. Linktree, Crimson Knights. Patreon, Crimson Knights. If you want. If not, it's fine. I won't hold it against you. Anyway. Like, without further ado, let's just get back to it shall we now now we did this tomb or no we did hold on did the tomb be marked complete there's a survival cache over here that I missed um can't get that yet that yet um why is that complete huh well I guess it's fine stop it. oh my god stop it um so yeah okay I'm gonna fast travel over to this base camp and then get that shadow shadow Survivor, uh, survive. Oh my God, English. Survivor cash. <laughs> anyway. Do 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 do. Wait, what? What? Hey, wood. Woody, 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 woody. Vulture? Vulture. Get up, Laura. <laughs> you just shot it down. I want one. I want it. Come on. Uh, it glitched into the damn tree. Of course it did. <laughs> All right, is there another one in the air? Uh oh. This way, up, up, up. <coughs> Damn. mad if I can't get down and can't get up there from down here. I can't get down there. Uh, fine. 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 Yeah. <laughs> 
now then. Now will you let me pick you up? No? Please? Fine. Ugh, I hate it. Alright, uh... Let us quick travel to here. And then back, because I want to see if it'll if that'll fix it or if it'll spawn another one and if it's not then we won't mess with it too much My friend, the queen is watching. Glad you could make it. How are you doing? How's your day been? Ah. Bitch. Baked bread? I must know more. Say more now. There we go. Condor feathers, not vulture. Condor. Condor feathers. Nice. That is very much a thing that I've been wanting to get into as well that I have been hesitant to because energy levels as well as, um, you know, space and money and stuff. Nice! What kind of bread did you make? Alright. So, can't get that yet. Get off the... Okay. Yes, okay, so I did that to him. Alright, 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 alright. So it's just this we have to worry about. That is this way. No need artisan bread. Interesting. Yields two loaves. Nice. <laughs> yeah, taxes. Something, 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 death and taxes, blah, 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 blah. But you got them done, or at least got major progress on them. In which case, kudos to you, you know. Any other arrows around? No? Okay. <clears throat> ah. Get a point! Ah. Fine. Hold on to it for now. Where did Elijah go? Did he... Okay, so we went over there. Not Elijah. God, I keep doing that! Jonah. It's because I know a guy named Elijah who very much reminds me of Jonah in that, like, pure, sweetheart, awesome, fun guy to hang around type of way. And also, they're both Bible names.
Nice, queen. Nice. There he is. There's old Jonah. 18th of July. <laughs> I awoke this morning at the sight of my father wringing his handkerchief tightly between his two hands. Wide-eyed and unblinking, he stared in Raleigh's direction. Raleigh had passed. Infection had set into his wounds days ago and shortly after, fever took hold. Between fits of cold sweats, laboured groans of pain and demented ramblings, Raleigh had somehow been able to insist on forging ahead. Father had tried to reason with him, telling him to turn back to let us carry the torch. But Raleigh made it clear. Turning our backs on him would have been leaving him there to die. We forged ahead. We were as far away from civilization as we had ever been, and we foolishly continued to trudge forward. So long, old friend. But yeah, Queen, I can see how that's complicated and, and annoying. What do you think we'll find in Kuak Yaku? Running water would be nice. I think at this point, I'd settle for no jaguars. Map. Oops, too far. A map that did not actually reveal anything I hadn't already found. Isn't that great? Get off of that. Seriously, game. map fights me it keeps locking onto these things and not letting me actually move it around like i'm wanting to ah, i wish i could turn that off but i don't think i can anyway all right so nothing new on the map shocker that oh there's um some good things on the floor here all good things, all good things. Don't want you don't want to go in there, Jonah. You, you you don't, trust me. Um this way. There's a road. Let's check it out. She's instantly fully covered in mud. I want this whole area sealed off. Yes, sir. If there's anything here, we're gonna find it. So first off, I'm gonna... Get us both murdered. Good to know. Good to know. Someone should check back there. 
And I'll put it right there. Make sure nothing can get through. I want this whole area sealed off. Yes, sir. If there's anything here, we're gonna find it. Gonna let you go. No, oh my god, look at Jonah go. When's the last time this thing was serviced? This is rusty. Don't get distracted, Mendez. What are we looking for here? Anything that moves, anything that doesn't. They still didn't find that relic. I'd love to be the guy that does. Not me. Why not? I'd be a hero. I'll be dead more likely. No thanks. I'll keep sitting here looking for hostiles. Less talking, more looking, gentlemen. Get off your asses. Yes, sir. What's your team doing? I'll check. We're not paying them to sightsee. I'll have to go under. Yeah. We know there's the main temple. What we're looking for is any smaller ruins we might have made before. Okay. It's really wet in there. I'm afraid if we move it, we'll lose it. We're gonna have to reinforce the bridge. Why didn't you test the bridge like I told you? Oh, I'm pretty sure we did test the bridge first. Fuck off. I'm not cut anymore. Maybe we can pull it out. Okay, maybe. Let me think about that. We can take them. You go left. I'll take these guys. What in God? Hide. Hey, Sammy. I told them to test the bridge first. You son of a. Hey, hey, Sammy. Jonah made it to the other side of the bridge. That's good. Jonah's fine. He doesn't need me to rush in after him and save him from the armed, heavily armed soldier that was, you know. Rushing in there after him. Nah, he, he, he doesn't need that help. Nah, 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 he's fine. He's fine. You was fine. Fuck you. Stop. Thanks. You okay? Yeah. Take this. Pistol and a rifle, all in one. I hope that's the last of them. Yeah. Not in a long shot. All right, hold on just a second. I need to do a thing. I need to do a thing. Where's the thing? Where's the thing? Okay. Well, that was close. Yeah. How'd they know to come here? I don't know. Not exactly the civilization I was hoping to run into. Ugh, my arm is so itchy. 
That means it's healing. I might have liked it better when it was injured. Oh, I know. I'm just trying not to think about my back. Does this look like instant death or hmm. instant death? Okay. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. We now know that that is instant death. That was close. Yeah. How'd they know to come here? I don't know. Not exactly the civilization I was hoping to. That means it's healing. I might have liked it better when it was injured. Oh, I know. I'm just trying not to think about my back. You know, my grandmother survived a tsunami in the 60s. What happened? She lost friends. Her family lost their business. But after that, she could feel things coming. Volcanic eruptions, storms, other things. What was your mother like? You don't talk about her as much. She was creative. Adventurous. I think she was probably the glue that kept us together. After her death, it was more lonely. That did it. On, let's go. Any idea what the quids in that riddle are? Could be anything. A pair of monuments or mountains or streams. I suppose we'll know it when we see it. Yeah. Hear music. That's usually a good sign. Look, civilization. Down there. Hope they're friendly. I'll let you do the talking. La <laughs> Stosa. Uwak Yaku in Peru. Peru. Hi. Do you know if there's a place nearby we could stay for the night? How'd you get so deep into the jungle? Did you lose your tour group or something? <sighs> There were some guys here before, looking for artifacts. You with them? Trinity. Definitely not. Uh, I need a break anyway. Come with me. Ooh, I like her sleeve tattoo. Oh. I'm sorry to ask so many questions, but the only B&B in town is my place. Well, you can't be too careful. By the way, I'm Jonah. Abby, Lara. Come in, have a seat. Carlos, free. <sighs> so, what are you here for exactly? Well, we were following a riddle when our plane went down. You mean it crashed? Yeah. <laughs> and you just walked out of the crash? Uh, Kinda. Well, you know, it was cruising pretty low. Also, this also uh, this chick is wearing jaguar skin. No mention of that at all. Anybody? <laughs> like she's not gonna be like. So I see you found some jaguars. <clears throat> all looking for. Maya like I mean, Williams. Maya, you know you're in Peru, right? <laughs> yeah. 
A long story. Oh. Thanks. Well, you don't seem like a typical archaeologist. Oh, she's the archaeologist. I'm, I'm just a cook. Really? Yeah. Have you tried any of our local ceviche yet? It's a specialty. <laughs> Not unless it grows in the jungle. No. Don't tell me you missed our famous fish trees. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're cute. Lara, you are very much a third Where wheel right now, my girl. Um, Mexico. Why? Oh, I've seen this symbol before. Wow. There are some ruins nearby, and a small rock with something like this carved on it. Do you mind if I take a look around? Uh, be my guest, but I guarantee they're not Mayan. My people were Inca and proud of it. Oh, I mean, uh -oh. it's like Why don't you rest for a while? It's like they were all sure? three pretty much connected and related. Well, I'm not going to say no to that. Have fun. Also, she was kind of flirting very heavy with uh, Monsieur Jonah. Friends, colleagues. She's brilliant. Hmm. So you're not. Oh, uh, no, <laughs> nothing like that. No, I'm a uh, pretty single. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> I... So you said you're Inca? Uh, not me. My ancestors, a uh, long way back, and then they were Quechua. And then after that, it gets muddy. I don't even speak the language. Where are you from? Hawaii, New Zealand. Which one feels like home? Both of them. Neither. <laughs> what about you? Lived here most of my life. Got my pilot's license in Lima. But when the oil company closed and I heard what was happening to you, I decided to come back. Have you ever heard anywhere else? Yeah. I'm just going to stand here and eavesdrop the whole time. Don't mind me. I want the tea. You into football? It's a pretty big sport around here. <laughs> yeah, I used to play, but things have been a bit busy lately. Probably for the best. Football's okay, but rugby, there's a real sport. No way. You got to change your mind about that. I'd like to see you try. They're so cute. Too. Do you have any others? Yeah. What are they? That's a secret. But maybe you'll find out someday. Créeme, es un borracho. Nunca en mi vida lo había visto tan ebrio como ahora. Porque solo se emborracha cuando está solo. Okay, so apparently. Entonces, ¿por qué no intervienes? Se supone que eres su amigo. Okay, so apparently these two are done. Es nueva aquí. La costumbre sea no hacer nada. Aunque beber y sudar ayuda a soportar el día. No, trabajo en un barco que golpeó unas rocas a las afueras de la ciudad. La tormenta llegó de la nada. Hundió el maldito barco. I need to stop eavesdropping. Like, jeez. <laughs> Don't mind me. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, ooh, what's over here? Salvage. Up there. There's that irrigation they were talking about. The clean water from up north. Or up the mountains, I mean, not up north. Maybe up north. I'm sure.
All right, we got a person. Forma parte del equipo de excavación? No, just passing through. Bien, si necesita algo, el Absolutely mercado está en el centro del pueblo. Podría abastecerse antes de continuar. Thank you. Fue un placer. But yeah, no, the tea is like the tea is good. <clears throat> Queen says, but the tea is piping hot. How could you not eavesdrop on every conversation? <laughs> Absolutely. But the thing is, if I do that, that's the next two or three uh, streams total. Llevo dos años tratando de reunir valor para invitarla a salir. Por fin lo hago y... ¿Quién es ese tipo? New base camp discovered. Ah, right over here. That would help. Thank God. The storm barely affected the village. The epicenter <laughs> was closer to the plane. But it could have been much worse. What have I done? What if the earthquake hits here? Hundreds of people will die. I need to find a way to stop it. So I adore the fact that she is in civilization now. She is in a town where there's people, food, beds, etc. And she still finds the nearest campfire and says, okay, nope, that's where I'm gonna be for the for the night. <laughs> oh man. All right. Never slip when grabbing ledges. More reactor time for traps or grappling enemies. Maybe. Uh, precision by holding charged charged shots for a longer time. Or this one. Or this one. Hmm. Let's go with this one. All right. Inventory. All right. All right, what we got for these guns here? All right, so we've got the gun that I just got, nicknamed the Altar Boy by Trinity Forces. A well-balanced pistol, good for all situations. All right. Silent Sting. Suppressed pistol for quieter kills. K&H cap. Uh, comfortable, reliable, a pistol to get you through the hard times. Or the AV-45 Gold Edition. Which is the same thing as this one, just gold. Alright, now we'll go with this one. Alright. Come on. got the Vicar Mark II. Standard issue assault rifle for Trinity Forces. Balanced and reliable in any climate or situation. The Gold Edition. And the Umbridge 380. Press fire gives your enemy a fatal ca case of lead poisoning while his allies remain and uh, nearby remain uh, none the wiser. All right. And we do have some stuff here. Come on. Here. Alright, I think that's everything I'm gonna upgrade for now. Oh wait, nope, 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 nope. Uh, there was one more thing I wanted to check. This thing, which is just gear. Okay. Okay. All right. 
so we need to go to the merchants. Uh, we came from here. <laughs> I'm just gonna read somebody's journal randomly. Miss Ortiz, your dedication and commitment to the village of Kwakiaku is commendable. However, Paul Veneer does not accept your charges of responsibility for the terrible state of the village. In fact, the Board of Executives has decided, and your local government representative agrees, if you continue this crusade of slandering our good name, we will have no choice but to take legal action. From the office of Roberto Lavia, Chief Executive Officer, Paul Veneer. Interesting. So there's some kind of town drama going on. Shocker. <clears throat> did I get the wood that was right there? I did. Okay. Alright. Now. You got anything to say to me? Ooh, look at them plantains! Or, or just straight up bananas. Pineapple. Ooh. Oh man, look at all that fruit. Hola, si conocer Yaku, puedo ayudarla. Are you the local tour guide? Mm. Sé a dónde ir. Y a quién no acercársele. I see. El mejor pescado es el del muelle, obvio. El licor de cerdo tiene los mejores tacos, pero la cerveza está caliente. <laughs> I'll watch out for that. Ah, y Omar, aléjese de ese tipo. No necesita sus problemas. Cree que puede venir a la ciudad y tomar lo que quiera. Right. Well, I'll be sure to keep an eye out for trouble. Ojos bien abiertos. All right. Ah, there's a pile of wood over here I walked right past. There we go. All right. Sorry about that. All righty. So there's a mission there. Merchant is there. Actually, now that I think about it, we didn't actually check up here, did we? If it'll let me. I won't let me pick it, but I can try to go up there. Uh, that's this way. <clears throat> Bienvenidos. Damn! Are you just are you gonna order something or just sit there? He's like, can't the guy just enjoy the view? He says, looking directly in Lara's direction with her back to him. Damn. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> yeah. So I came from the left up here, which is right here, I think. Yeah. And there's apparently nothing to the right. Okay, even though the map says there should be. All right, good to know. All righty. Anything down the, down the shore? Uh, bit. Hold on. Let's go for a swim. Oh. 
O. Hey, it's Kisse. A new base camp discovered, huh? And secrets revealed on the map. Ah. Them be some secrets. Indeed. All right, let's light this fire. Light it up, 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 light it up, up, up. Light it up, 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 up. on fire. All right. Let's go look into this treasure chest. I probably need a, ooh, something was going underwater. Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think it make my collection complete? Oh, I need to hit air. Air, air, air. Air, air. <laughs> and now I, I've set the queen off singing in 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 the dis in the Discord. <laughs> no regrets. Fiction There's of no Inky. mistaking that bright golden disc. Inti, the most important god of the Inca. He was the god of the sun, protector of the people, and the provider of warmth and light. Some legends also credit him with teaching humans the ways of civilization. And the Incan emperors were either considered his lineal descendants or physical incarnations of Inti on Earth, depending on which emperor you asked. Of course. Monolith discovered. This describes something nearby. Take a deep breath and find me right under another's nose. Take a deep breath and find me right under another's nose. Okay. Ah, oh, I think I know. Okay. An this iron cast mold. iron conical mold was mainly used throughout the 60s and 70s to shape small gold ingots. Its unique shape causes the gold to settle at the bottom, separating it from impurities. I had no doubt, Queen. I had no doubt. There was not a single doubt in my mind that that was all from memory. In fact, I'd have surprised I'd have been surprised if it was anything else.
get off the log. Okay, fine. Take a breath. Go under. Grab the thing. All right, now, now, now. Grab this. There's something there. Get some breath. And then... Now let's get some more breath before we go in. I still need the lock picks for that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Using gear lock picks. Okay. Okay, I do see some salvage over here that I want to get. And then we'll go back to land. I don't want to... I don't want to explore too far because I don't want to risk triggering something that I'm not ready to trigger. Let's go over here. Oh, wait. Skill points. Um. El motor quedó inservible. 
¿Y dónde están los remos? Uh, los dejé en casa. <ríe> Mejor me quedo callada. Mira, ¿y qué tal si en lugar de los remos usamos las manos para...? Tomás Ortega, te avientas ahora mismo al agua y empiezas a nadar. Esta es mi camisa favorita. ¿Quieres llevarla en tu funeral? <risa> ¿Ha visto a mi marido? ¿O a mi hija? I don't think so. Where did you last see them? Pasan las noches con las estrellas, brillando y saludándome. <coughs> Pero por la mañana viajan al río. Oh. Normalmente los veo brillando ahí. Pero la tormenta entre las olas aguas. Sé que están ahí abajo. Sé que lo están. Oh. Fresh fish. Manga, le mostraste un santo día de beber cerveza con los amigotes. A Prim, pero sería mucho pedir que me ayude de vez en cuando. Apuesto a que nunca había visto nada así, ¿eh? Solo me queda esto. Le vendí el resto a ese buen comandante. Un poco intenso, pero lo importante es que me compró todo, ¿no? Bueno, excepto este. Funciona sin problemas. Nunca se descompone. Una belleza, ¿no? Oh, wow. No, es en serio. Aquí mi esposa no ha sido la misma desde el accidente. Pero el sonido suave la ayuda a relajarse. I'm glad. Sí, pero este chamba tan antiguo que me ayude de vez en cuando más pequeño. Ay, ya me moriría de aburrimiento. Solía ver un templo en la isla, por ahí. Pero todo lo que queda son un par de muros derrumbados. And one stone pillar, it looks like. Eso es más una estatua que una columna. Un trabajo complicado. Un profesor universitario vino a estudiarla hace unos años. Did he tell you what he learned? Dijo que no tenía ningún sentido. Estaba bastante enojado por eso también. Dijo que tratamos de engañarlo o algo así. <risa> Talking about that pillar that I went and found that riddle on. The one that's got me uh, pointed over here. Disculpe. ¿La conozco? Sorry, I didn't realize this was a private residence. Vaya, perdimos mucho, pero no sabía que había sido tanto. I really didn't mean to. Sé que no fue así. Si nos disculpa, tenemos mucho que hacer. Jeez. Just gonna... La gente cree que puede entrar y salir a su antojo. Es propiedad privada. Y propiedad privada. La tormenta se llevó todo, pero esto aún es mío. Damn. Yeah. It did look more like a porch than anything else, but like Damn. Señor, gracias por tu gracia. Ayúdanos a superar los obstáculos que nos hacen tropezar y danos la fortaleza y la sabiduría para levantar la mirada y ver la esperanza que tenemos en Cristo. En el nombre de Jesús. Amén. Amén. Salvage? It is. Yes. More salvage. 
Okay. Look at this stuff. Hands and techniques. God damn it. <laughs> Worst songs that could could be stuck in my head. here eventually. Here's the fish market again. Private residence. Hace muchos, muchos años, eso era un templo. O sea, ¿antes de que tú nacieras? Uh, mucho antes. Incluso antes de que naciera el abuelo. ¿Y qué le pasó? Era su tiempo. Qué triste. Pero siempre y cuando lo recordemos en nuestros corazones y en nuestros actos, seguirá con nosotros. ¿Como al abuelo? Sí, igual que al abuelo. Oh. Oh, damn. Gently around the furniture. All right. Even more stuff. Look at this stuff. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't you think my lore is complete? All right, pardon me. All righty. Looks like this is Abby's family tree. Her family has lived in this village for hundreds of years, and it seems as though she's somehow related to most of the villagers. Nice. I've been doing some research, and I think we might be able to set ourselves up with a homemade refinery. It's going to be a lot of work, though, and I can't do it alone. We'll need to build an oil tank, 1,000 liter capacity. The hull of the ship sunk in the river could be used for the tank. Any volunteers for a salvage mission? We'll need to set up a system to collect the crude. Who wants to be in charge of the bucket brigade? Once we get these things set up, we should be able to make diesel, kerosene, and petrol. Enough to fly the planes and eventually maybe even turn a profit. Nice. pueblo. <laughs> Y así todos podrán salir de la rutina. ¿Qué tal un pastel? ¿Dónde conseguiremos un pastel? Eh, haciendo uno. Bien, tú quedas a cargo de eso. <risa> Otra vez. 
otra tormenta como la última y el río se llevará toda la aldea. Quizás sea lo mejor. Ay, solo estás disgustado por todo el trabajo extra que tenemos que hacer. No se equivoca. Prefería estar jugando con ellos. La última vez jugaste a los All right, so we came from there, went down there. Can't go in here. We have been in here. Yes. Yes. Okay. In here. Nothing? Okay. Omar. Uh -huh. Estuvieron trabajando toda la noche. And? Isn't that what they're paid for? Get lost. Shit. No. Now fuck off and let me watch the damn what game. What is that? an asshole that's what it is i'll talk to him in a second poor guy got kicked downstairs man not cool <clears throat> right, siempre es bueno guy. ver caras nuevas en el pueblo sienta bien saber que no han olvidado este rinconcito del mundo y también le sienta bien al bolsillo Si tiene la gentileza de echarle un vistazo a lo que vendemos en la tienda. ¿Qué estamos tratando de descubrir? Fue una granizada completamente inesperada. Ni los satélites ni ninguna estación meteorológica mostró nada. Y de un momento a otro. La jungla toma lo que quiere. Es difícil conseguir que revele sus secretos. Pero encontré uno. Creo. El pueblo tiene muchas capas. Remueves una y encuentras otra. Y otra. A veces me pregunto si no ha estado aquí. De una manera u otra, desde el principio, parece diferente a los otros. Todos. Hombres buscando petróleo, oro. Se llevan todo lo que pueden. Fair. Continue to restrict the distribution of supplies. When we come through the area, it's better for everyone if your people are more concerned with their next meal or their child's fever, rather than with what's happening outside the village. As promised, once our investigation in the area is complete, we will provide monthly rations equal to double what you currently receive from care. Hey, glad you could make it even if you can't stay. Thanks for the pop in. I hope you've been doing well. I hope you're doing okay. Continue to restrict the distribution of supplies. <clears throat> when we come through the area, it's better for everyone if your people are more concerned with their next meal or their child's fever rather than with what's happening outside the village. As promised, once our investigation in the area is complete, we will provide monthly rations equal to double what you currently receive from care for 24 months, provided you keep up your end of the bargain. Cordially, Estela Diaz, Director of Community Outreach Programs, Order of Trinity. All right, so there's somebody in town who's screwing with the supplies of this town uh, who's working for Trinity. So that people will be will be too self absorbed to think about what Trinity's doing. And I bet I know who that is. Bet it's that Omar asshole. Lot. Me encantaría sacar estos ladrones de aquí. 
Everything all right? No, todo está mal como siempre. Uh, Estos saqueadores vienen a la ciudad, nos contratan para desenterrar nuestras propias reliquias, no nos pagan un salario digno. And then they run off with them and profit. Todos estamos desesperados. No hay trabajo desde que por venir se fue. Somos blancos fáciles. And I imagine a storm hasn't helped matters. Lo poco que teníamos se fue o está bajo el agua. Ya no sé qué hacer. I have some experience with these kinds of people. Maybe I can help. No sé de qué servirá. ¿Cuál era tu nombre? Laura. Soy Víctor. Si quieres hablar con Omar, el director ejecutivo de robos y saqueos, está allá. Thanks. Ten cuidado. No le gusta que lo desafíen. Time to talk to Omar. Anything I can take from him? No. Piss off, you're spoiling the reception. I wish I could like pull a gun on him. Oma? Who are you? Looking for work? Um... Well, you're out of luck. We have enough people. Marco's in charge of HR now anyway. <laughs> oh, uh, yes, thank you. Do you know where he is? Where else? The bar. The answer's the same. There we go. I'm looking for Marco. Eh? Para qué? I just want to talk to him. No quiere problemas. I'm not looking for trouble. I'm looking for work. Trabajo? Ah, sí, sí, claro. So, you're Marco? Dígame que Omar no le envió para molestarme. Tell me who Omar didn't send you the message. Como alguno de esos animales, les a mi hijo. Yo. Marco, I'm not with Omar. Believe me. What's this about your son? Como me golpeé la rodilla. Omar puso a Pablo a reemplazarme en la excavación. Dijo que como estoy a cargo de recursos humanos, es mi trabajo buscar un reemplazo o... Otherwise, he'd keep working your son. Sí, me preocupa que retenga a Pablo allá aunque yo lleve a alguien. Well, it's a good thing you've just hired someone. ¿Usted de verdad haría eso? We wouldn't want to disappoint the boss, would we? Gracias. Si ve a Pablo, por favor, dígale que estoy aquí. All right, so that wants me to come over here. Uh, but I've got some other stuff I want to do first. Like, there's this crypt here. A mural over here and another crypt over here. But I also really want to hit the merchant, so that, that looks like that's objectively our next step is the merchant. Okay, then over there, and there, then over there, talk to him, talk to them, talk to Omar. Acaban de llegar, eh? Qué suerte. Se salvó de una tormenta horrible. I, uh, I had a brush with it myself. El viento arrasó la jungla cercana. Derribó un árbol. Cortó la electricidad. Un par de casas se derrumbaron. I'm sorry. No es tu culpa. A no ser que controles el clima. Well, well, she may not control the weather, but she definitely did unleash some shit. No vienen muchos oh. turistas por aquí. Oh, I'm not a tourist. I mean, I'm a researcher. 
De todos modos, ojalá hubiese visto este lugar hace 20 años, en auge, vibrante, lleno de vida y de optimismo hacia el futuro. Pff, optimista. Más como crédulo. What happened? Por venir fue lo que pasó. Una petrolera grande fuera de Lima. Vinieron, se ganaron a la gente, les dieron trabajo a todos. Incluso iban a construir condominios al otro lado del río. Hasta que todo se vino abajo. The oil crash. Ahora nos arrastramos en las obras que dejaron. Lástima que no sea turista. Ellos traen dinero. Los investigadores se lo llevan. She ain't wrong. Researchers do. Just take. Alright. What is that? For the new oil company. Wood. You got wood. Powder. Burial doll replica. Traditionally woven from fabric and stuffed with weeds and grains, <coughs> the burial dolls are frequently shown holding something in their hand like a musical instrument or a ball of yarn. In this instance, the doll is holding a toddler, perhaps signifying the deceased was a mother. But this one is made from modern materials. I suppose Paul Vanier could have made it as a promotional toy. Okay, so came from here, then all throughout here. Didn't go further than that. Uh, okay, okay. All right, I think we're ready to just go up to the market or the merchant. That's the word I was looking for. Wood. Thank you. Miss Ortiz, thank you for your recent inquiry. A water quality index, WQI, was calculated for river sites surrounding the village of Kawakyaku from the samples you provided, and results have shown that the river sites should be classified as bad water quality. The results of the study have shown large scale impacts that include siltation, chemical pollution, and heavy metal pollution. Turbidity and total solids exceeded the environmental limits. Water of high turbidity, hazy, murky water, cannot be used as potable water, and the high total solids also imply that it cannot be used as irrigation water as well, as this will damage infrastructure. It is most likely that any subsistence fishing that took place before is no longer possible at the affected river sites, thereby impacting negatively on people's livelihoods. Similarly, pH was in the high alkaline range as well as COD. These parameters were indicative of some chemical pollution in the river. The pH, that is alkaline, hard water, is corrosive and can damage plumbing equipment and clothes. High levels of fluoride in the water poses the risk of diseases such as dental and skeletal fluorosis. The presence of pathogenic bacteria such as salmonella also represents an immediate health risk for the local community. So, not good. Has this noticias de tu hija últimamente? ¿Está? Ah, está bien. Yo solo quisiera que viviera más cerca, pero Este sitio no puede ofrecerle nada, lo sé. Pero eso es temporal, Dayan. Es lo que intentamos cambiar, ¿no? ¿Quién eres y qué hiciste con Rico? ¿Cuándo te volviste tan optimista? No sé. Creo que me gusta la dirección en la que Abigail nos está llevando. Cuando terminemos aquí. 
La casa comunitaria necesita reparaciones. ¿De nuevo? ¿Qué pasa ahora? ¿El techo? ¿Los cimientos? La pared trasera está goteando según León. El hoyo es más pequeño esta vez. Supongo que debemos agradecer por eso. Esa camisa que traes es muy bonita. ¿Las hacen para hombres? <risa> muy gracioso. Tú no te ves muy sexy. ¿Yo? Eso dice cuán poco sabes de estilo. Esto es lo que usarán en las pasarelas de París este año. Mis disculpas, madame. No sabía que fuera una experta en moda. Disculpa aceptada. Ahora, terminemos esto. Iré a que me hagan la manicura en una hora. ¿Yo también? God, I love that conversation. Nunca lo había visto por aquí. I just got in, but I won't be staying long. Que la apariencia no te engañe. Es un buen lugar. Difícil, pero bueno. Your garden seems to survive the storm. Suerte y trabajo duro. Mucha gente ayudó en la siembra, así que también quieren protegerlo. Aww. All full up. Can't carry any more. No sé nada de jardinería. Solo veo hierbas. Ten algo de fe, Miguel. Las semillas germinan cuando reciben suficiente sol. Mm. ¿Suficiente sol? Siempre está lloviendo. Es más fácil encontrar oro. Los brotes también necesitan agua, Miguel. ¿Y qué si llueve demasiado? ¿Ahogan las semillas? Para alguien que no sabe nada de jardinería, sí que te comportas como alguien que sabe... <laughs> for, for someone who knows nothing about gardening, you certainly think you know a lot about gardening. Seem to think you know a lot. Oy vey. Alrighty then. Have I been in there? I think I've been in here. Let me confirm. Okay. Acaba de llegar, eh? Qué suerte. Se salvó okay, de una talk. tormenta horrible. I, uh, I had a brush with it myself. El viento arrasó la jungla cercana. Derribó un árbol. Cortó la electricidad. Un par de casas se derrumbaron. I'm sorry. No es tu culpa. A no ser que controles el clima. ¿Es nueva? Debería hablar con Abigail. Abigail. Insiste en hablar con los recién llegados. You mean Abby? We've met. She's been very helpful. Esa es nuestra <coughs> Abigail. Siempre lista para reparar algún generador o detener alguna discusión. Es la alcaldesa de facto, dueña no oficial de una tienda, la mitad del departamento de bomberos. Y créame, es mejor no pelear con ella. I wonder how she gets all that on her business card. <laughs> okay, well, um, good luck with everything. Yeah, that was a poor taste joke, but also not a not a good joke in the first place. Like, even if there, even if it wasn't in poor taste, it absolutely was a bad joke. <laughs> All right, there was a person over. Oh, that's what I for. This is the story of local cabins rumored to be haunted. Ghostly noises coming from deep within the bowels of the earth. No one who's entered the caves has ever returned. Mysterious sounds. Something between the booming of thunder and the howling of dogs. And a mysterious light glowing within. No entiendo cómo pueden chismorrear con tanto ánimo cuando hemos perdido tanto. I'm sorry. ¿Eh? Usted no es Mariela. No, I'm just uh so sorry to bother you. Si le interesa, tengo algunas cosas para comerciar. Hello. Déjeme adivinar. 
Omar la envió a extorsionarme. <ríe> Sepa que no le daré nada a ese bastardo. ¿Qué estás hablando? ¿De qué estoy? <ríe> Disculpe, vi el cuchillo y el arma y pensé que... <ríe> Olvídelo. ¿Busca algo en particular o solo está viendo? ¿Qué tienes? ¿Qué tengo? Esto es Kubak Yaku, uno de los principales sitios arqueológicos de Sudamérica. Bueno, podría South hacerlo. Well, Debería good. hacerlo. If it weren't for pillages. Exacto. Omar y sus matones van tras el dinero, no tras la historia. Tengo a la venta artículos culturales importantes. Un poco dañados, pero vale la pena restaurarlos. All right, let's see what we what we what we can get here. Uh, we can buy salvage from him, but I'm pretty good on salvage for now. Same with black powder. All right, upgrades. I can get a revolver from him. I can get a set new semi-auto, a new rifle. Pistol sight. The suppressor. Hmm. All right, what do we, how much do we have? 5,000. Okay, well, first off, let me sell all my gold ore. Es un buen trato para ambos. Jade ore as well. Disfrútelo. All right. Have anything else to sell? Not really. All right. So then, let's see here. Let's get the pistol sight. Excelente lección. And the suppressor. Es un buen trato para ambos. And the ammo pouches. Excelente lección. Es un buen trato para ambos. All right. Now. That should be good for now. Yeah. Because I can't afford any of the other things that I actually want, and I'm good on everything else. For now. Un placer hacer negocios con usted. All right. Now. Jonah, I found Incan ruins, but I think the foundation of the temple is older. Yeah, Abby remembered where she saw that symbol. It's inside the temple somewhere. Great. Tell her thank you for me. I'm right here. You can thank me by not breaking anything. Mireya, the Incan god of the moon. He was relatively low in status, so he didn't have a mate. This tells the story of how he reshaped his sperm into the form of a fruit, which impregnated the goddess Kavirka when she ate it. Hmm. This pregnancy came as quite a surprise since Kavirka was a virgin. But when her son was born, the boy immediately solved the question of his paternity by crawling right towards Coney Rea. Kavirka was so humiliated by Coney Rea's low standing that she fled with her son to Peru, where they turned into coastal rocks. Damn. Damn. I mean, damn. Like, I mean, that, that whole thing, whole thing, whoo, all right, oh boy, all right, um, give me my, Hola. Los escucho clamar desde las profundidades. Las voces. Los antiguos dioses. Maybe you just need to rest. No. Véalo usted misma. Mire cómo el aliento de los dioses sube desde las entrañas de la tierra. Escuche sus aullidos de dolor. I have noticed that. Where is this breath? Lo verá. Lo oirá. Quizá pueda aliviar su sufrimiento. 
to a tomb. Okay. Damn it. There we go. Alright, let us go this way. Let's do the crypt first. Oh, did I talk to you? Este pueblo estuvo una vez bajo el ala y la atención del cóndor, pero dejamos que el águila lo ahuyentara. I'm not sure I understand. Yo tampoco. Nos perdimos en nuestra búsqueda. Pensé que seríamos más felices con monedas en los bolsillos, pero el águila también se llevó eso. Eagle. No soy capaz de hacerlo, Bache. Vamos, es fácil. Solo agárrala y métela el petardo por el. Ya sabes qué. Tiene. ¿Ya sabes qué? ¿De qué otra manera va a cagar? No, no quiero hacerlo. Es muy malvado. Mejor hagamos volar piñas y listo. ¿Qué le decimos a Javier? ¿Decirle que conseguimos mascotas? ¡Súper! Kids were up to no good in their neighborhood. Holy shit. Full up, can't carry any more. Someone has barricaded the path. All full up, can't carry any more. Looks like the bridge is out.
Jeez. Okay. This room has fared better than the rest of the cavern, it seems. I don't think I can actually get there from here.
It's in gear. I need the shotgun to get past that. So, actually, before I do that. This is a little bit unusual. It shows herds of sheep, llamas, and goats. But one farmer wouldn't usually tend three distinct herds like this. That one llama, alone on the hill. That must be Urquachile, the Incan god who watches over animals. Urquachile was often depicted as a llama. This is a dedication from all the local herders to the one who protects their flocks, thanking Urquachile for the preservation of their livelihood. Oh. All right, skill point. Let's increase swimming speed. Forty. Pistole. Hit a trigger, why not? Ooh. And improved injector. Immediately. Immediately fully upgraded pistol. Hello. I'm gonna try something probably stupid. All right, that's a challenge then. Cool. I have to destroy four more barrels. Um, one there, if I can hit it. Salvage. All full up. Can't carry any more. Okay. 
There is a relic here. All full up. Can't carry any more. <laughs> All full up. Can't carry any more. This is a promotional model of an oil derrick made out of cheap plastic and copper. There is a logo for a company called Paul Veneer on the base of it. All full up. Can't carry any more. So there was a, I swear to God, there we go. All right, somewhere in this radius, underwater, because take a deep breath. All right, so I need to go somewhere where I could swim right here, for example. Aha, there is that and right there. Alrighty. Now, I have to run to the bathroom, so I'll be right back. Don't y'all go anywhere. Back to it. Um, there we go.
all full up. Can't carry any more. Pull up, can't carry any more. All full up, can't carry any more. Yes, I am aware, Lara. You don't have to say it every time I get even close to one of those bushes. All full up, can't carry any more. Size nine. I don't have enough space for that. Please don't, please don't say that every time we get close. Okay. Not every time. That's fair. And acceptable. Oh, hello. I missed. Come on. Here we go. Can't do that one yet. Quite make the dialect out. Dragon, this must be depicting Pachamama, the Incan goddess of motherhood, earth, and time. She presided over fertility, the harvest, and planting. Her body was the mountains, and she was also the cause of earthquakes. People used to make miniature pieces of clothing with highly intricate designs solely for the purpose of burning them in dedication to her. That would account for the scorch marks on the floor. And those brown stains must be llama blood. Another popular sacrifice. Uh, he's over yeah a new base camp for that. hell yeah salvage and wood get wood okay and this uh, this one leads back to where the market is over there okay 
Trinity is really on edge. Still, if they're here, they're ahead of us. At least it means I'm on some sort of track. If Dominguez is right and her son is dying, I have to get to that box before he does. All full up. Can't carry any more. Well then, let's make some arrows, shall we? There's a thing right there. Missing gear, need a shotgun. Okay. All full up. Can't carry any more. Make sure there's nothing else to do. Alright. Alright, onwards. Onwards as far as it'll let us. I don't have enough space for that. Ooh, I'm cool. Alright, cool.
Okay. Impossible. I can't carry any more. I need the rope ascender for that. You can put a you. Up in there. Up in here. Yep. Hmm. Well, nothing ventured, nothing gained. I yee That's death. Let's go this way. I don't have enough space for that. Interesting. Wolves, great. The walls are porous. The oil must be seeping through. In other words, gotta be careful with, uh, some, uh... <coughs> some, uh, firearms. Don't need to fully set myself and everything around us and go kaboom boom. All right.
on, do the thing that I need you to do. Oh, helps if I'm on the right. There we go. Close up. Alright, this is where I fell. When the caverns begin to howl, a warrior must descend to ease the torment. If one cannot be sacrificed, then all will die. Interesting. of the village have lied to us there is no beast underground the howling we hear is only the wind rushing out through small caves leading to the surface they've used fear to control us for too long once I make my way out of this infernal sweat bath I will throw their lies at their feet Botan is an ancient Maya god of war and death. So old, he is rumored to have been old even before the beginning of time itself. He is usually depicted as having no teeth, <clears throat> being colored entirely black. Little is known about him, except that he likes to smoke pungent cigars. Interestingly, he is also the god who invented drumming. That's where I came up. Immediately went that way. Base camp. Alright, skill point. Uh I guess I have to take this one. That's the only only one. Everything else is two cost. Yep. Alright. We are making progress, y'all. be the way out okay so this is the way out oh oh <laughs> okay that works all right so i need to a... okay that works fine Trying to be cool, but I guess I won't. Sure not. God of death. I'll have to get over there. I'll have to get that fire out. I said E. There's my way across. Need to get to that ledge. Working on it. Use you. There you go. Oh, shit. Need to extinguish. 
extinguish the fire. Working on it. Blockage on the other side. Yes, yes, Laura. Yes, yes, my dear. Yes, yes. Oh. oh fuck. Good morning. If I don't do this immediately. Strong for me to cross. I'm waiting. It's fine. <laughs> Honestly, that's one of the lamest death scenes that they've given her. Because she has all these fucking guns. So I cleared the blockage. I guess it wants me to close the damn window. Fine. Ugh. No. Jump, Lara. Jump. probably have closed those ones too now that I think about it. Let me go close this first one. While I'm thinking about it. Come on, push it back. All the way. Yay! There we go. Oh wait, if it just rests, it will No, no it won't. Maybe. Maybe. If it's just resting, it might block the path. Grab and push. All right. Okay, yeah, no, it doesn't block the path. Good, 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 good. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. I'll need more power. Oh, is that a thing over there, miss? Hold on. It is. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Yes, Lara. We're on it, Lara. Give us a second, Lara. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Holding it in place. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Girl, release the damn thing. All right. Here he is. No. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Girl, I swear to Christ. Almost there. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Mm. 
There hmm. must be a way to unblock the shutters. Maybe I don't have the piece of equipment I need? Do I, do I need the rope ascender for this? It didn't... Where am I? Come on. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Hmm. I don't think I can get up on top of that and like tether that to that and have that bullet. I don't think that would work. Cool if it did, but I don't think it will. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Um and again I'm not seeing anything over there. So I really must need the other thing. Alright. Alright, we'll come back later. Hey Lavi. Might be the way out. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. All right. This is how I exit the tomb. Yep, and we're okay with that, Lara. I promise. There must be a way to I think this is the way out. Wait on the impossible. I can't carry any more. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Girl, we are long past the shutters. I swear to god, if she keeps saying the thing about the shutters, I'm gonna be so so fucking livid. <laughs> Laura, Laura, I pushed the button and everything. There you go. There must be a way to unblock the shutters. Girl, I swear to God, you better not keep on that once you leave the cave. I swear to God. There must be. That's the dead way. There we go. Possible. I can't carry any more. All right. Um, can't get that. Can't go deeper into that. Um, 
Um, can't get those yet. Ah, mouse. Do what I'm telling you to. There we go. Alright, so. So. I think. So eight, is that, or not eight, nine, nine, oh my god. 943 English. Uh, can't get in there. I'll go sh try to shoot an eagle. I'm going to take a I think the yes, foundation we know. of the temple is older. Yeah, Abby remembered where she saw that symbol. It's inside the temple somewhere. Great. Tell her thank you for me. I'm right here. You can thank me by not breaking anything. <laughs> I'll be right there, Lara. There we go. Right into the mud. All right. Hi, hello, my friend. Creo que puedo ayudarle. Hola, hola. All right. Um. Have more to sell. Excelente lección. Es un buen trato para ambos. All right. Um. We don't yet have the ability to use this, so we might as well sell Excelente these. Excelente lección. Same with these. Disfrútelo. Um. There's so many feathers everywhere. Might as well. Es un buen trato para ambos. Keeping the, the wood though. Um, and the meds and the perception plants. Well, I'll sell half of them. Excelente lección. And I'll sell half of this. Es un buen trato para ambos. Um, all right. So now that, <clears throat> what do we want? Um, buy some salvage. Nah, nah. Let's buy the pistol. Pistole. Excelente lección. And then we're gonna buy the because we have the nine strides as boots. Because we got that from that one crypt. So let's get the, es un the buen trato para ambos. chest piece. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> All right. Siempre listo para los negocios. Gracias. All right. Now. Let's go free that guy's kid from Omar's bitches. But first, base camp. Alright, 
inventory. Alright. Right now, right now the AB45 is more powerful, so it's one worth using because um, it's fully created. We're going to stick with the AB5 for now. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This. Okay. All right. Evening Star's Cape and Boots gives perception duration and quite, uh, Oh, I see, I see. Um, perception duration and gain additional plant and mineral crafting resources from each source. Nine strides gives gain additional fat, black powder, and salvage resources from each source. I might go with that. Uh, and this increases the amount of ammunition crafted on the run. I do want to do that. You know what? We'll do that. Too. We'll do the whole set. Ooh. Definitely like that better than the Jaguar top. But the Jaguar top, let's see here. It's good for stealth. Yeah, so we'll 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 keep this combo for now. Um We have nine minutes to go free. Uh I think his name was Pablo, but he was Omar's son. Past the garden. Right, 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 right. Oh, I missed this. Come on. Okay. Nope, too soon still. So. Oh, I am so sorry, my my friend. Uh, amigo. Almost called him on the me. Wrong, wrong thing. In we go to save the day. Da -da 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 -da. Oh. This is a dedication to Supe, god of death and ruler of Uku Pasha, the Incan underworld. It entreats him to come forth with his legions of demons and to converge on this site, where the local people will do him honor with written poems extolling his greatness or offerings of food and drink. By paying him the respect he deserves in this way, the local people pray he will only take those he must and not harm any others of their community unnecessarily. Fair. Are you Pablo? Si. It's okay. Your father sent me. He's at Abby's. Go meet him there. I'll take care of these guys. Gracias. Muchísimas gracias. Oh, the hug. Get out of here. That doesn't 
sound good. What the hell got into him? He used to bring us ten people a week. If you ask me, it's that brother of his. Always unionization this and justice that. Wow, wow, wow. Fucking snowflake. Are the fines here even worth it? Uh, on the black market. Fucking True. Me. Almost 100% markup on whatever we get from it. <laughs> I should have let him finish talking, but I don't care enough. Right. Need to get back to the village. Gather your things, I go back to the village. Bendiciones. Gracias. An ink ink and sacrificial this knife, knife is a cheap plastic replica of those traditionally used to sacrifice llamas in the Inti Raini or Sun God Festival. It was also occasionally used to perform trepanning surgery. The Inca believed that cutting a hole in the skull could relieve pressure to cure some diseases. I mean, if you have if you have certain headaches and you don't, you know, it does genuinely feel like that might help. I've had some headaches where I absolutely would have tried anything to relieve the pressure, you know? They'll get back to the village on their own. We're going to leave the rest of the bodies for either the villagers to handle or the jungle to reclaim. hilarious would it have been if she had just stumbled fell forward face first into the fucking mud 
Because you did stumble. So they saw Pablo running towards Abby's. Let's go talk to them. 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 I'ma put a bullet in Omar. Oh, nope, Omar ain't here. Hmm. Hmm. Pablo me dijo lo que hizo. No, no sé qué decir, solo gracias. Of course. Hace muchos años, cuando mi abuelo era niño, vinieron unos hombres que querían talar en los alrededores de la aldea. Todos tenían miedo de enfrentarlos, menos mi abuelo. Un muchacho de 15 años, con un arma vacía, defendió la aldea e hizo que hombres que lo doblaban en tamaño regresaran por donde habían llegado. Sometimes the courage of one person can outweigh the cowardice of dozens. Aún tengo el arma que él llevaba entonces. Quiero que la conserve como símbolo de valentía y de mi gratitud. Don't you want to give that to Pablo? Mi pequeño quiere ser doctor como su mamá. Oh. ¿Y usted Valid. cómo es que se llama? Lara. Ya tengo una nueva historia para contar, Lara. Gracias. The River Hawk. Powerful pistol that deals high damage. All right. Skills. Two skill points available. All right. Where do we want to put them? A flare round attachment to all pistols. Flare rounds ignite unarmored enemies and blind surrounding enemies for a few seconds. Nice. Craft lure arrows. Attract and kill nearby enemies with a poison cloud. When triggered, oh, viper snare, lure traps on enemy corpses, breath capacity when swimming underwater, tempting, tempting, uh, kill a second enemy during a stealth takedown to perform a chained takedown, tempting, tempting, uh, you know me and my stealth kills. Incapacitate arm unarmored enemies with a counterattack after dodging. Mm, I love that too. Resist damage from enemies for a short period of time after healing. Reach full draw weight more quickly. Reduce time between charged shots. Next weapon upgrade. I'm not in a hurry for that. Rival instincts last for a longer period after Lara starts to move. Highlights enemies, resources, and objects it in... One with the jungle difficulty. Ah, yes. Reveal traps while using survival instinct. I might upgrade survival instinct. Increase the chance of finding rare animal. Ah, uh, it's down to either owl's vision or serpent's fury. Hmm. Owl's vision. I need to be able to find the resources. Yeah, inventory. All right, where is the? There's the river hawk. Pop a pistol that deals high damage. Oh, look at it. The 44 caliber gun. I hope he doesn't have a problem with us uh, actually putting ammo into it. Question is so it can only have the pistol sight, not the silencer. So if I want the silencer, then I need to use some of the others. Hmm. How does the river hawk stand up to the altar boy? 
Hmm. Unfortunately, because of how upgraded the altar boy is, the river hawk it doesn't stand up to it quite well enough. Um. All right. Uh All right. So yeah. We're going to call it there. Welcome to uh Kuwakyaku. Uh, next time we will be next time we'll be uh, going for the current objective here of uh, pressing into this uh, temple or ruins that they found that uh, she's found um, and uh, you know explore those but uh, yeah uh, that'll be next week maybe uh, you know it should be next week we'll, we'll know for sure when we get there um but uh yeah and till then i'll be back tomorrow with more spyro um i did get very frustrated with the game i was still having a lot of fun don't get me wrong i, was, I did get very frustrated with spyro uh last week um but since then i lost so many lives so many lives in one specific level and it was just uh but i did get frustrated but uh we're past that level finally uh we're ready to move on to the next um area in the in the game and uh i did a lot of grinding uh over the weekends in the game so i have i'm back up to about 20 lives you know <clears throat> and all that type of stuff so we can just tomorrow we can just go through it and not have to worry about you know being too careful um but uh yeah before we head out you should oops it helps if i push the right buttons you should absolutely check out these amazing people i have listed up here i have even more recommendations in that link tree right down there below and speaking of that link tree uh which is link tree slash crimson knight uh if you go there that's where you can find my socials my discord it's where you can find me basically like you can find all of my stuff there socials discord youtube um throne wish list patreon you know they're all in there um and you should definitely check them out um you know you can follow me for updates and check my vods out if you missed a stream and want to catch up and so on and so forth <laughs> or you can join my patreon and support me uh through that way if you so choose if not that's fine i won't hold it against you it's not a requirement or anything like that it's just you know it might be nice if not it's fine but anyway uh so yeah uh if you want to do that that's patreon.com slash crimson knight just as it's shown on screen and yeah anyway uh like i said that's it for me for the night so um yeah we'll be back tomorrow and so until then remember to have empathy be kind be safe love yourselves and love everyone around you and i will see you all tomorrow I love you all. Peace out.